Hi, I'm Steve Hunt, professional sailor and coach of the national champion Point Loma High School sailing team. You'll probably recognize me on Sailx as Flo. I've been playing Sailx for the last five years because I really enjoy it, and it helps me keep my strategy, tactical, and rules knowledge sharp. Given this, I thought it'd be fun to give back and host a series of lessons over the next few weeks to help you improve your results in the upcoming championships. I hope you enjoy the lessons, and I'll see you on the water soon. Welcome to lesson number one by Steve Hunt, starting at the favorite end. In this lesson, I'll be sailing flow on Sailex here in 2D. I started sailing years ago in 2D, and I've become comfortable with it. Uh, I enjoy 3D as well, but I'm a little more comfortable in 2D, so we'll use that for the lesson. <clears throat> the main point that I want to drive home in this lesson is that in sailboat racing, you need to start near the favored end. You know, at least 90% of the time, you want to be starting near the favored end. And there's a real simple reason, and that it puts you ahead in the race. The windward end of the line, the favored end, is closer to the weather mark than the other end. So by starting at the favored end, you're actually closer to your destination, which is the windward mark. Therefore, you're ahead of most of the fleet. Here we have 5 degrees left favored, meaning the pin is favored by 5 degrees. So I'm going to want to start near the pin. You may wonder when you might not start near the favored end, and that would be if the other side of the race course is extremely favored. So here it's a little bit of a dilemma. I see a little more wind on the right side, but the pin is significantly favored, 5 degrees. It's enough for me to warrant starting near the favored end. Maybe if it was favored 1 or 2 degrees, I'd start near the boat because there's more wind on the right. But 5 degrees is enough to get me down here at the pen. And I'm, I might be late here because I'm busy talking. But let's see if I can get to the line in time. It's becoming more and more pen favored. I might even tack at the gun here. Let's see if I can cross. So I start at the favored end by myself. And I'm immediately crossing most boats because they started near the committee boat. Got a right shift here, now it's three degrees left favored. I'm guessing it's about to come back to the left, now four degrees, five degrees. Beautiful. So as you can see, by starting at the favored end, I am now either winning the race or maybe in second or third compared to not in ESP. I was a little bit off the line. That late lefty got me, I was a little too far away. But big picture, I'm looking real good here. I'm definitely in the top group. And in a series of races, you just want to be in the top group over and over and over again. And that hopefully by the end of the regatta, you're winning. So here we'll just keep on sailing, head towards the right where there's more wind, play the shifts, and uh, hopefully around the mark in good shape. Here's another example of starting at the favorite end. Seven, six, it's eight degrees favored. I'm going to try to attack at the gun here and cross. <clears throat> Just crossing everyone. Again, left side was favored, further upwind. It wasn't that crowded, so I got speed, tacked at the gun. We're in lasers here, so attack's not that painful. Probably couldn't have pulled that off in a catamaran or maybe not a big boat. But in a boat that tacks easily, felt like I had it, made it, and now you see the wind is slowly going to the right. It was 8 degrees, pin favored. Now it's 6 degrees, meaning the wind is slowly clicking right. And there's more wind on the right. So we're off to the races here. <clears throat> 